Well, hey guys, welcome back. You know how much I love these old Timex Iron Man watches. Uh, I can't let it go to waste. This one had a broken band. It's beat up pretty bad, but you know, this would make an awesome like kayaking watch or something uh, that you wanted to do. I, I can't find the band right now. Like they're out of stock. I don't know what's going on, but it's kind of crazy. You can't even find a band. So I went ahead and I dug the spring bars out. I already got this one in on this side. I've just got this cheapo NATO band I got off of Amazon. I'll leave a I'll leave a, uh, a link in that description to show you guys, but I just wanted to show you how easy this is. Now, I can't get enough space to thread it through with the spring bars in, so I have to remove the spring bar and just kind of lay the band on. Now, a lot of you will probably say, but why? Because this is so ugly, but that's the beauty of it. It is so customized and, you know, kind of, you know, you. So, uh, like I said, make a great kayak watch. So all I do is I pull those spring bars out and then uh, just get them started on one side. And you got to be careful so you don't send this flying uh, across the room. But then you, uh, oh, didn't get it quite in there, did we? Let's, uh, I'll tell you, this is a lot easier without the camera in the way. <laughs> Okay, I think I got to start at that time. I'm going to take my spring bar tool, press this side in, and then we can maneuver it around until we get it in place. I think we're in there. I can't move it with my spring bar. Let me... Oh, yeah, there we go. Um, so now I can bring this back through, and we're ready to try that on the wrist. Now... Yeah, a lot of you are probably going to say this band looks a little odd being so thin when it's used to being a thick band, thick type band on a regular Iron Man. Uh, yeah, I would agree. But like I said, if you're going kayaking, going hunting, something like that, and you know you don't want to wear your uh, your normal one, this would definitely do. You could always throw this in your truck and and leave it there as a just in case. Anyway, just a fun little thing I tried real quick. Uh, see how it turned out. I'll do some shots on the wrist and. Uh, and some close-ups of it and we'll we'll see how it looks thanks for watching guys stay tuned for those we'll see you next time